Here is the experiment we propose to demonstrate the effect of the decrease of the sea ice surface in favor of the increase of the ocean surface on the climate. We take two sheets of paper of the same size, one light in color and one dark. We place them horizontally at the same distance from a light source. We then place two squares of chocolate in the middle of each sheet of paper. You may draw a cross in the middle of the sheet, or fold the sheet. Let us now have a look at our chocolate squares during the experiment. Are they melting? Mmm, I can almost smell hot chocolate! At the end of the experiment, we observe that with the same light source, the chocolate on the dark surface has melted faster than the one on the white surface. In other words, the chocolate on the black surface received more thermal energy than the one in the white surface. We highlighted the albedo phenomenon. A white surface reflects a large part of the energy that it receives in all directions, whereas a black surface absorbs almost all of the energy it receives. This absorbed energy will then be partially re-emitted as infrared radiation, which, in addition to the lamp, will heat up the chocolate too. In the context of climate change, we observe that the loss of white areas, such as sea ice and continental ice, in favor of dark areas like oceans and land, leads to an extra absorption of solar energy and thus to a greater temperature rise.